can you choose a cigar just based on how it looks? And if you can't, or why or why not? Can can I personally or just in general? I think maybe in general. both. In general. Yeah. Okay. You, um, you can't do both then. Yeah. So for um yeah, I, I, I guess I, I guess I'll, I'll say it in general. Um, you can't, uh, ju- you know, as as in life, you know, you shouldn't judge a book by its cover because there have been some hidden gems out there that have some gnarly wrappers on them, and mm-hmm. then all of a sudden it's like, whoa, what is this? And I remember, like the the Henry Clay Brevis when that came in, that was like a true, like the old box press, the true meaning of they threw cigars in there, they pressed the box down, and however that cigar came out, that's how it came out. And um, so there were, um, yeah, I, I'd say, yeah, never, never judge a book by its cover because I, I thought those were, were hardy and, and really good. But, um, but yeah, looking at, I, also with that said, you can also see based on either, you know, price point or, uh, or the company, you know, did they take their time when they put the cigar together? You know, when you're looking at the seams of the, of the cigar, did they rush the roll, um, how the cap was put on? how the bands were put on. So um, it's a little bit of both. You can, you know, walk a fine line, but uh, I, I'd say, you know, if the percentage, you know, if we're looking at 50%, I'd say, I'd say, no, don't, don't judge it just by, just by looking at it. On a flip side of that question. So if someone is new to cigars, how should they go about choosing a cigar if they don't do it on just how it looks? Go to your local tobacconist. They are your, um, they are your guides, you know, through the, through the humidor. And you'll be able to, you know, if you visit the shop enough, you'll be able to pick your, almost your favorite, um, you know, tobacconist because they'll, they'll understand your palate a little bit better. Um, you know, going into a restaurant, you know, the, the waiter's talking about the specials or what would you recommend off the menu? Uh, they'll, they'll ask you, well, do you like, you, you like your food spicy? What kind of, you know, are you, you know, are you afraid of texture or, um, you know, things like that. So, if you're a new cigar smoker, um, it's it's not only you know the the research that you can do beforehand, but going to someone and ask them questions too, and Inter- almost interview them. You know, see what kind of coffee they drink, or you know, do they drink uh, spirits or you know wines, or what kind of foods they like, because then that will kind of show you as a new smoker what kind of palate they have. Right? Because my spice is very different from from your spice, mm-hmm. more than likely, right? Er- you know, everyone's different. Um, so yeah, interview, interview them, but go to your local brick and mortar, get some, get some help. 